If you have been on the internet at any point over the last few months, then you have experienced those huge banner pop-ups as you visited your favorite sites. Over at Cinedis, we have baked up the perfect explanation on exactly what these internet cookies are and what this means for your privacy online. So stay tuned to find out just how the cookie crumbles in our new series called Cookie Cookie Crunch. Well, you can't eat me, so what's the point? Internet cookies may not be edible, but they are still very important because they track your information and behaviors online. Let's dive into the ingredients to update you on everything that goes into your cookies. Internet cookies were initially created for the use of online shopping carts. The job was to store your data with parts of their size on your computer until the next time you visited the site. When you accept a website's cookie policy, you're giving them permission to perform actions such as location tracking, storing your layout preferences, or even your browsing patterns. Many times, it is said that this is done for the sake of improving their services for you. That doesn't sound too bad. So what's the big deal? I'm getting to it. Many of these websites partner together with third-party companies to give you what they think you want. Whether that's skipping your clothes for next weekend's beach visit in your checkout cart, or remembering the time and dates you search for flights to Cabo, this is how companies decide how to market themselves to users. See, I'm harmless. You can be, but not quite. Many countries are cracking down on multiple and repeated abuses by corporations, launching investigations and passing new legislation, such as the GDPR, in order to protect the privacy and transparency rights of their citizens. Therefore, companies were required to revise their privacy policies and notify their users on exactly what information they are collecting, so now with the permission of their users. This explains the big pop-ups begging you to accept. They ain't gonna read them. They don't care. Realistically, most of you aren't going to start reading these policies simply because, well, you don't think it matters or because you don't have time. We knew this would happen, so we created a few quick and easy tips to keep you safe and secure online. First, you may modify your browser's security or privacy settings by changing your cookie preferences. In your browser's settings, you have the power to choose when and which websites may install cookies. Second, you may use incognito, aka private browsing, located under the file tab to browse through the internet without new or old cookies being able to track you. And finally, staying connected with Cinedis by following us on our social media pages is the best way to stay updated on all things cybersecurity. Did you learn anything new today? What concerns do you have about your privacy online? If you enjoyed today's Food for Thought, drop some cookies in our comments. Until next time, you can find the best tips on cybersecurity and more from Cinedis on our YouTube channel. I am Frederick, thanks for watching, and remember, be safe online and offline.